I'm Joe Zekas. I'm here from New York, Chicago. I'm with uh, Sarah Boner, who's with Zillow. Hi, Joe. And we're going to talk Zillow today. Yeah. Uh, we're going to talk uh, about a range of things. Uh, I've been fascinated by some of the tools you've rolled out. So sure. tell me a little bit. Well, to go back to when Zillow originally launched in February of 2006, the first tool that we made available to the public was people could look up what their house is worth online. We pulled from public records a number of public sources to kind of get an estimation of what we thought their house was worth based on these records. So were, were people looking at their house or were they looking at their boss's house, their sure, girlfriend's house? Sure, I'm sure we house, had a little bit their... of everything. Um, we do allow people to claim their house and we've had 830,000 people claim their own house. So, um, you know, I'm sure you get a little of the whole ex-wife, girlfriend, boss thing, but uh, people definitely were looking up their own house as well and we, we have the numbers to prove that. So that was the first tool that we rolled out to the public. Um, we wanted, people came to us and said, you know, you don't have the right information on my house. I've since added on or I've upgraded my kitchen. So a couple months later, we opened up the database and we allow them to edit that. Um, we allow them to tell us about the granite or tell us about the city view that they might have. So that was the why, next why, step. Why would they do that? Isn't that just helping the tax assessor raise their taxes? Um, well, people take a lot of pride in their home, and so they want it to be accurately um, portrayed online. And some people are starting to think about getting into the market, potentially selling their house. So again, they wanted their information to be reflected accurately. Okay. And then, uh, so yeah, from there the next tool that we rolled out was allowing people, like kind of like what I just said, they're starting to think about going on to the market, so now they could actually post what was for sale. Um, we let anybody post their information, whether you're a homeowner or you're an agent. Uh, they can tell us what's for sale. Uh, we have over 50,000 agents that have registered on the site and have begun to post their information on sale. And we have over a million consumers that have registered on the site. Some of those people have told us it's for sale. Some of the people are just participating in some of the communities that we also recently launched online. And you have kind of an uh, unusual name for one of those features, Make Me Move? Make Me Move, yeah. That was definitely a unique approach to kind of dipping your toe into the real estate market. Uh, what Make Me Move is, is maybe you're not ready to actually go meet with an agent. Um, but is anybody ever ready to meet with an agent? <laughs> yeah. Well, this is just a way to kind of get their, like I said, their toe in the pool. They can say, uh, you know, maybe I don't want to move today, but if somebody were to come and offer me this magic number, I would definitely entertain the offer. Sometimes the, uh, you know, sometimes the number is not realistic because they really don't want to move, but as the date actually comes where they are, do want to get to the market, that number becomes a lot more realistic and potentially even moves into a for sale posting then. I've seen some that are uh, below your value estimates too. So well, there's a deal for you. There's, there's a deal for you. <laughs> No, but that's again, we let we let the homeowners go online and write maybe why the estimate might be low or high and really have an opportunity to tell their, their house's story on, on Zillow. That, that's pretty much all the consumer stuff and consumers love Zillow. Uh, let's talk about some of the agent tools that you have because sure. my take is uh, Zillow appears to be one of the greatest marketing platforms I've ever seen for real estate agents. Great. And I don't see that many using it as effectively as they should. Yeah, um, well we do, like I said, we have 50,000 agents registered today on the site, so they're, they're starting to understand it. Um, there was some controversy when Zillow launched. Nobody really knew what it was going to be. And I think as we've rolled out these media products, people have come to understand that really we do just want to be a marketing platform. We're not there to get involved in the transaction in any way. Um, and one of the ways we've done this is by allowing agents to post all of their listings online for free. So as agents, I know it's difficult as an agent. You have so many places that you can put your listing online. Where do you spend your time? And Zillow today is about 4 million users. Four million unique users coming to the site every month so as this audience has grown do you know how many of those are buyers and how many are sellers yeah about 53 percent of our audience plans to buy or sell within the next two years so um, sure half of our audience is looking at probably more the home valuation side of the business or maybe participating in one of our neighborhood forums but about
about half of them are actively in the market right now. So as that number comes out, as the 4 million unique users comes out, uh, realtors begin to see that this is a very effective and good mark audience to get their listings in front of, and they're starting to use it more and more. Um, one of the ways that we hope to engage the agent even further is in August we plan to start taking feeds from brokers and from agents. So it has been a challenge for them because it's been a one-by-one -one upload to date, although it's been uh, you know, a good thing, to, a good way to spend 15 minutes to get your listings online. Um, it'll be even it'll be here's, nice. Here's where I step in and I say, I don't don't understand real estate agents. Here's this great platform that's reaching a large number of buyers and sellers. In five minutes you can put a spectacular listing on there for free and reach a greatly targeted audience. Right. And you're too lazy to do that? Um, no comment from Zillow. On it. <laughs> well, it's definitely something they should be doing. Um, I can. There's a lot of noise in the real estate space. I'm sure it's challenging for them to understand where to spend their time. But like you, I agree that spending five minutes to upload your listing on Zillow is an excellent opportunity for for agents. Um, and it's for it's free. So go out there, upload as many photos as you want. You know, write a nice home description. The lead goes directly to you. Um, we don't track the lead or take the information off the lead in any way. The lead goes directly to you and there's an opportunity to advertise your website as well.